Hello everybody and welcome or welcome back to the second shelf and to a um, video that is quite different from my regular videos. Even though I uploaded or will upload it on a Sunday, my regular day of upload. Um, first of all, this video is going to be short and you've never seen a short video from me. I mean, I tend to babble and the length of my video is mostly more than 15 minutes, but this will be shorter. Second of all, there's the difference that this video, as you could have seen from the intro, is about a male author. And if you follow my channel, you know that I normally talk about exclusively, almost exclusively, I have this, you know, the best dudes once a year, but normally I talk about books by female authors. That's why I started this channel to promote uh, female authors, books by female authors. So to, to dedicate a whole video to one male author, is different. But of course, you know, I could not not talk about Salman Rushdie after what happened a uh, day before yesterday. And now that he is hopefully on the way to recovery, he's been taken off the ventilator, um, he's able to talk, I was thinking I would like to do something to support him. Also something that he will appreciate as support. Um, and I am a fellow writer, even though Salman Rushdie is in a completely different league than I am. But still, I was thinking, what would I want? And normally, uh, if there is something horrible happening, whether it's an, a natural disaster or a man-made catastrophe or an attack, you will have NGOs or uh, uh, bank accounts that you can donate money to in order to support the victims, in order to help the victims, in order to rebuild or what have you. I don't want to donate money to Salman Rushdie, at least not directly, but I want to buy a book. My way of supporting him and also suggesting to you to support him if you are so inclined is to buy a book by him. Preferably new, because that means more support than a used book for various uh, royalty reasons, but buy a, a new book by him. If you want to buy the Satanic Verses, because that's something uh, that will show your support, you know, more uh, profoundly, if you feel uh, that way, by that, of course. But my point is more by buying a book, you support him, you support freedom of expression, you support literature, um, and you can buy any book. <laughs> I mean, of course you can. Um, the book that might be one that you want to buy if you haven't read it and haven't bought it is his book most famous or most popular because the most famous is of course the satanic verses but that's midnight's children published in the 1980s um and it is about um the indian the independence of india uh and a child uh the idea is children born at midnight of the day of independence and the book follows one particular child and it is about identity it's very much also about uh, Rushdie's own search for identity, even though it's not auto fiction or what have you, but it's definitely something that is very close to his heart. So Midnight's Children might be, be a good pick. The book that I will buy is my absolute favorite book by him, a brilliant book in my opinion, and that's his memoir, uh, Joseph Anton, which was published 2012. And this book is all about the uh, the years after the fatwa, Valentine's Day 1989, and the years he had to have police protection and go into hiding. Um, this is a book uh, without any self-pity, but it really gives you an idea of what it meant to live under these circumstances. And for me, this is the most yeah, quote unquote, relevant book for what happened. So I will buy this book again. It will be my third <laughs> book because I have the ebook, I have this one, and I will buy another edition of this book. So if you feel that's a good idea, 
Maybe you want to buy a book by Salman Rushdie as well. In any case, thank you very much for watching. I'm looking forward to your comments as always, and I will resume the normal schedule uh, of my videos. Um, this is Sunday, probably on Wednesday. And until then, have a very, very good Sunday.